Now, ladies, I gotta know, have you ever circled back to an old lover only for things to be terrible over and over again? Or did old roots bear new fruit? Mm. Let me just say that if I did not go back to my ex, I would not have my beautiful son, which is now my Aww. baby daddy and my boyfriend. So mm -hmm. yeah, I feel like sometimes you gotta give people grace and you gotta go back. Like I love my man and I love my baby. So if I didn't go back and give him a chance, we wouldn't have my beautiful baby. But yeah. how did you know like it was okay to go back to him? I just feel like the things that we went through that caused us to break up was a part of us not being mature. Like he just was not ready for everything I was bringing to the mm -hmm. table. Like I came to the table ready. I wanted to get married. I wanted mm -hmm. to do all these things. And he's like, wait, I'm young. I'm trying to be outside a little bit. I love you, but I want to be over here. So I think us separating and then when we came back and he's like, I don't want to lose you. You're worth me like becoming a better man and wanting to do better things in my life. I think he had to realize that. Mm -hmm. So that's what kind of brought us back into a space of like, let's do life together. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Have you ever double back? Hell nah. But the reason why is because I'm going to give you, I don't gave you nine lives Yeah, I get before mm -hmm. I left. I'm not the type that'll just leave because you f***ed up because yeah. I be really wanting it to work out. So I done stayed so long that now it became a pattern. So even if I wanted it to work out, even if I wanted to go back, I'm now programmed to your pattern. The patterns never change. Yeah. Like, yeah. I, if you go somewhere you did something before, I'm gonna be like, damn, he going to do this. Cause now you gotta be very comforting and kind of like, a over explainer, a very good communicator. Right, I get that, but I do feel like the patterns don't change thing is not all the way necessarily true. I feel like if somebody really wants to be with you, then they know they have to turn, change certain things in order to be with you. I think it depends on what the patterns are. Yeah. So if it's yeah, something definitely. that's disrespectful yeah. to like, you're, you're a cheater, or you put your hands on me, or you degrade me, yeah, that's like a think, those are reasons why I would absolutely not go back. Yeah. And I think that those patterns are very hard for people to change. Yeah. But I feel like if it's something as simple of us needing to mature mm -hmm. or sometimes they don't work out because mm -hmm. one of us isn't where we want to be in life. Right. If we've had enough time to grow apart separately and then come back, then it could it work. Made sense. Right. It made sense of why we needed that break. Right. But I do feel like, it, like I said, those are my absolute no's. I'm not going back. I and agree. most of the time, I don't go back, right. like, yeah. ever. It's been one or two times where I'm like, all right, let me give this person a new chance because so much time has passed yeah. and we're in different places in our right. lives. Okay, what about not going back for a relationship? Like, I, I probably went back accidentally for stay. <laughs> Like, okay, that's a different double back. That's different. And I think that a lot of times we do double back when it comes to like intimacy because we don't want to add more numbers or bodies and to that our person, list. And that person knows your body. Like your mm -hmm. ex gonna know your body the way a new man ain't gonna know your body. Like yeah. he's gonna be able to do things that the new man don't even know you like. So a lot <laughs> of the times we want to go back to that ex like, ooh, he gonna do that thing I like. Like I gotta go You're back, crazy. I gotta go get that. But I think it's familiar <laughs> shit too. Like if yeah. a woman goes back to their ex, I think she just familiar with him. even outside of sex because if he do something like some shit, you're gonna be like, that's some shit Tyrone would do. Right. Because you kind of expect it. Yeah. But do you feel like that we as black women do that unconsciously because we've been conditioned to hold down mm. or to stay regardless and we gotta uplift and give yeah. these I men think it's familiar. multiple times. I think it's a part of it, honestly. I think that a lot of other nationalities, they don't really go back. Like, yeah. white women are like, I'm gonna marry this one person, this is my husband for my life. And like, and black women, we always kind of like, he's gonna change. I need to stay with him. Yeah. He done been through a lot. Like, we always gotta kind of be that, that mm -hmm. structure back for a man yeah. where a lot of women, other women don't do that. It stems from our parents too sometimes. Like, if you've seen your mother stay with your father through certain things, or you've seen her stay with men that, you know, weren't really up to her standards, but she was just like, I'm gonna stick through this because I'm a strong woman. We always get stuck with that strong black woman. It's like, that's over, I feel like. I um, was considering doubling back because it didn't end with either of us disrespecting each other mm -hmm. or cheating on each other. There was no infidelity. It was just, hey, maybe he had to figure out who he was as a man. So it's like, because I wasn't disrespected, I'm open to doubling back. And I left that door open. Right. When you be who you, when you become who you are, then come look, at, look me Ooh. up, find me. Right, but my thing with that is, you go back to this person that was living their dreams and doing their thing, and maybe they didn't disrespect you, but why didn't he see something in you that said, like, I want to bring her up with me? Like, why aren't men doing the same thing that we do for them? Black men especially, like, he was living his life. He could have said, I see something in you. I love you. I want to take you with me. Let me teach you the way while I'm learning the way. Girl, like, men think... age 40 years later. So yeah, when he that's was a problem. Young, but I'm saying, even if she was, you said, like, when you was younger, right? Like, even when you meet somebody at 30, that man, like, 21. Right, like, right, right. It is, it is I get it. that, but I would want him to kind of see something in me, too. Like, why didn't you see that? Now that I'm lit, it's easy. It's easy now. <laughs>